Welcome to week 12 of the Machine Learning and Dynamic Optimization course. This is the week of the final exam, and then beyond this week, we're going to be working on course project. Let me give an overview of what we've learned so far in the course. We started off the course learning about physics-based and machine-learned models through regression, and also we covered classification and some of the other machine learning methods to take data and convert it into actionable information. We also covered collocation approaches where you solve differential equations very efficiently by solving them simultaneously between the objective function and the equations. We then talked about batch or a recursive method for updating the models and this was through moving horizon estimation that's similar to a reinforcement learning approach. We then went on to predictive control and optimization. In particular, some benchmark problems and other strategies to set up and solve optimization problems, taking our models and data and converting them into actionable information. So throughout all of this process, we relied on gradient-based optimizers and also machine learning packages. Some of the most popular ones that are out there, all programmed in Python and some of the applications in MATLAB as well. So I hope you've enjoyed this course. It's been an overview of some of the theory and applications of machine learning and dynamic optimization with control and estimation and modeling approaches. Now, with this course, the next phase of it is going to be the course projects. And I hope you have now uh, gotten into your groups and have felt productive in this collaboration between industrial or university participants. And I hope that for the rest of the course, even after the final exam, you're able to take the information that you've learned and apply it not only in this course project, but in your research or work-related activities.